Hey guys and girls, I'm Ellie, and today we're watching Rick and Morty Season 3, Episode 5, The Whirly Durly Conspiracy. Don't know what to expect. Last time we had um, a hero group, um, which basically died out, you know. Um, one person survived, and Rick and Morty. But yeah, there was this beautiful little moment where we thought, yeah, Morty might be appreciated by Rick. I mean, drunk Rick. But, you know, it didn't really go well. <laughs> it wasn't Morty he was talking about. But, um, thinking about it, I didn't say it after the episode last time, but thinking about it again, he did in his not too drunk state, in his no not blackout state. He did have the notion that it might be Morty he is talking about. And he seemed a little bit like I wouldn't say shy, but kind of he So there was something there. I'm I'm going to I'm gonna hold on to that. Like, in his non-blackout state, he was actually thinking that he might have been thinking about Morty during that whole ordeal. And that, well, that means that he basically has to value Morty. Else he wouldn't, like, get to that conclusion. Even though he was saying, yeah, he's doing that based on logic and uh, because they are here. Um, but his facial expressions and stuff like that kind of show that there might just be... Yeah, he values Morty and he thought maybe that that mm, is what my drunken me wanted to say. But honestly... Yeah. The moment was kind of ruined in the end. But yeah, uh, this time, I don't know. What will happen? I don't really expect anything. But, you know, we're just gonna jump in. And if you like this video, you can give it a thumbs up. You can subscribe if you want to see more of this. And you can join the Discord server to join a good, great community that has helped me through a lot already. <laughs> and, um,. Yeah, and there's also the link to the Patreon in the description where you can get Rick and Morty episodes one or two weeks earlier and the uncut reactions with a timer as well as a Patreon-only show. Um, and yeah, that that's basically it. But um, yeah, I guess we will just start out with this episode, which I know nothing about. <sighs> Let's start in three, two, one, and go. Visiting Jerry. He doesn't seem good. Kind of sad. Come on, Jerry, Jerry, come on. We gotta go. Okay. We gotta come with me, Jerry. Rick? It's important, Jerry. <laughs> the fate of the galaxy rests on your shoulders. Let's go. Put some pants on. Oh. Never, never mind. There's no time for pants, Jerry. I'll make you a pair of pants on the way. It's a Rick and Jerry adventure. Rick and Jerry episode. Sure. Why not? It's not Rick and Morty. It's Rick and Jerry now.
Wow. Hmm. Wow. Hmm. Well, so does that mean Rick is the master convincer? <laughs> At least he's he has clothes now. Hmm. Nothing dangerous. Well, what the, what just happened? Oh, that's why it's safe. Yeah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> At least they have a fun time, right? hideous yeah what is that Okay, what is she gonna do? She got broken up with. Is she gonna try to change herself? Okay, okay, that, that, I mean, yeah, he's not gonna die. Hmm. Well. Are they gonna try to kill Rick? <laughs> so that's why the title. And right in that moment they want to kill him. Hmm. 
Yeah. But if Jerry helps killing Rick, Beth would not take him back. Like, she wouldn't forgive him. Summer, don't... Oh my god. Yeah, not too... Don't do too much. Yeah, that's not... Told you you shouldn't do that. Just be yourself, please. That was summer. Yeah. Yeah, um This is I don't know if you can handle that right now. Yeah, she's gonna be too proud. Okay. I'm I'm curious about this talk. Wow. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Jerry is um, trying to do that. Um, I mean, her proportions are normal. Yeah, it's... She's gonna re reverse to that... Reverse skin. Okay. Please just... <sighs> oh, shit, eh? Okay. Sorry, there was a bit defender ad. Yeah, Jerry is like, sometimes he wants to basically kill him and sometimes he doesn't. He's not gonna actually get killed, so... Well, at least he didn't die. Jerry basically had a change of heart. I mean, this is <laughs> this is an interesting fight since, like, okay. Oops. Well, that's a. Uh oh. Well, now you can die. You you just killed her. That's why you shouldn't kill someone on purpose. Oops.
Hmm. Yeah, um... Wow. I'm sorry I'm not saying much right now, but, like, um... That cuts deep. Wait, what? Um, sure, uh, well, what they were talking about just now, that is, yeah, I think Jerry would, mm would like to be at the destination by now. What is gonna happen? Those were the three little men. Oops. Wow. Wow, where did she go? Please get her back. Really? Okay. Hmm. That's actually in very interesting, you know, Wow. Okay. I mean, Morty knows a little bit about parenting. You don't just like, you, you tell your children they look good because they do. You don't seem weird if you do, you know? Wow, Jerry's having fun. <laughs> shoot, shoot. Um. Wow.
Well, um... Wow. Um, how about saving a bullet? <laughs> Sure. Woo. Um. Uh, what is this? What is happening? Is he high? <laughs> This is weird. Um, that's not looking good. Yeah, that's true. But, like... Well! Hmm. Yeah, okay, back to this, because we still need to save Summer. <laughs> really? <laughs> they just... <laughs> okay. Beth just wants to talk to her. And Morty's watching. Well, that's certainly something. Wow. Um, <laughs> Morty's just, <laughs> he's looking out for his sister. Wow, that is at least something. So was the smile being like, oh, he doesn't want to come in, I'm fine with that, or, ah, oh, he's actually like, you know, um, trying to be a different person. I have no idea. And I saw Clancy Brown in the voices. Just thought I'd mention that.
Yeah, your retirement is not long. But yeah, uh, Morty kind of threatened Ethan and it seems like he made sure that um, he wouldn't forget. But yeah, that was an interesting episode. First of all, the whole Jerry and Rick stuff. Well, that talk, or like those talks, were interesting. Um, it's, it's nice to see like how Jerry deals with all of that. Um, and since Rick and Jerry were kind of like the people that were like, okay, if one of us stays, the other can't stay because it's not working like that. Um, since, yeah, okay, the marriage between Beth and Jerry might not have been ideal, but since Beth wanted to impress her father so much, uh, it just got worse. So I can understand both sides of the story. I can understand when Rick says, hey, your marriage was fucked up before, um, but, um, I think they might have gone through this if uh, Rick wouldn't have returned. I mean, it would have been way more different if Rick wouldn't have left at all, so... Yeah. Like that one part when he was talking about like, yeah, she had options and you ruined it for her. That is when I feel like the, the dad feelings coming up. That is when he's like, okay, I wanted a good life for my daughter, but she doesn't have it and I'm gonna blame it on you um, because everything was fine before she met you or something like that. Um, so I can kind of feel a little bit sympathy for that since he, he wanted the best for Beth. Fine by me. Um, the way he's showing it is uh, not the best, but you know. And Jerry is probably not gonna kill himself. He found a little bit of his, like, confidence back. I don't know. But he doesn't want to be the one who's pitied by everyone anymore. So um, I'm curious to see if he's gonna, if that's gonna mean more in the future. So if he's gonna try and, you know, change himself or like kind of just be better. Um, I, I, I don't want to say like better in a way like that he will, he's not a good person. He is a good person, but he wants to feel less, <sighs> how do I say that? He wants people to notice that he can stand up for himself if he wants to and, um, stuff like that. So I'm curious to see if that's going to play a role in future episodes. Other than that, the beautiful other plot with Morty, Summer, and Beth, uh, wow. Like, Summer, dear, don't, don't change anything about you. You're, you're fine just as you are. And your ex-boyfriend learned his lesson. I'm sure about that. <laughs> Um, and look, this is what I mean, like, Morty looking out for Summer, even like Beth being like, okay, first she's way too proud, but then she's changing herself just so she can talk to Summer and make it better. So she recognized her mistake and she, well, she does basically everything to make it better. Um, she is a good mom. Not every moment, but like in, in the long term. <laughs> Let's just say it like that. Yeah, and Morty looking out for Summer is just the best part of it. I, like I said before, I love their sibling relationship. I love how Morty was just like with this very threatening like, he's a little kid, basically, still. he He's just a little boy. But he can be very threatening. And he made, made sure that Ethan knew that it was serious. 
We saw that in the post credit scene. <laughs> I like it when Morty gets so protective of his sister. That's that's nice to see. But yeah. Other than that, I don't think I have anything else to say. So on this note, have a nice day. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.